What does it take to be a Hall of Famer? Being a world champion? Fight the best of your era. Fight the best of your era. Yeah. If you beat Dillian, Wilder and Fury, yeah. you're in the Hall of Famer. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, definitely. <laughs>definitely the fight AJ wanted from the get-go really and I felt that without the Deontay Wilder situation Dillian White was the right fight. When we opened negotiations with, with the Saudis to fight Deontay Wilder I, I'll be honest I was looking for a softer opponent. What excites you about watching Anthony Joshua and Dillian White running it back? Look I think it's the obvious right it's the needle they don't like each other I think going into that second fight obviously fought in the amateurs that that was sort of playing on AJ's mind a little bit. He'll say it probably wasn't, it was early days, but he wanted to get that one over Dillian White and the pros. Now it's one all, their careers are on the line. For AJ, he's looking for his best year yet, which is Jermaine Franklin, Dillian White, Deontay Wilder. It's a hell of a run. sold out already. sold out, yeah? Good business. Well, good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to London ahead of a fight that I can't still believe is happening. Anthony Joshua against Dillian White, August 12th, O2 Arena, live and exclusive on the Zone pay-per-view. A massive fight for the heavyweight division. AJ, yep. saw you in Dallas last week. Yep. Everything, every conversation about this August 12th. How come you didn't come to Florida to see me in the Florida said AJ? You see what I'm saying? You be bullshitting, man. <laughs> What? You be bullshitting. What, you went all the way to Dallas to see you. You didn't go to Florida to see me. You be bullshitting. I didn't man. think you were going to take the fight. You be bullshitting, man. I didn't think you were going to take you the gotta fight. You got to stop that. Yeah. You got to stop that. Seriously. Okay. Yeah. I didn't think you'd take the fight. You didn't think I'd take the fight. No. You're going to Mexico anyway. You didn't think I'd take the fight. Yeah, I was going. I was going Dallas to Mexico. Uh, it was on a stopover. Uh, okay, can I ask one you. question? Go on. What does AJ's balls stay like? <laughs> <laughs> you might find out. Take this fight with this risk ahead of everybody knows about the Wilder fight and that and the, the, the negotiations. Forget and the, Wilder and them lot. Them lot have been doing my head for so many years. Like you lot have seen now the shenanigans in the heavyweight division. Even with, uh, I'll be real, like Fury saying <coughs> that he was training for Usyk. Sugar Hill come out and said that, no, I'm not training him. What do you mean I'm training him for a heavyweight championship fight? You can see all the lies that's been going on. So I don't really waste my time with time wasters. I could fight now. Do you know what I'm saying? It's in your heart. That's what matters. He says he doesn't like me and he hates me. I think he's in the right. I'm happy for the guy who's doing well. He's done well. He's done a lot for British boxing. I don't hate him. I don't hate him, but he hates me. I don't know why. The talk is always he hates me and he wants to beat me up and smash my head in and stuff, but I ain't got nothing against him. I'm glad that another young man's doing well and changed his life and provided for his family. I'm happy for him. Because, well, let's be honest here, yeah, if AJ fights, I can't believe and if you, if you don't knock the guy out, oh, he's done it. He's Who said that? Right. No, Who no, said no, that? That's what you guys say. No, me. Yeah, I mean, like, I said it, that. It, it, I, I've, I've got tired of guys. Oh, unbelievable, great. You know, oh, beautiful. Shall we, shall we just, like, beat our Spencer? Shall we just beat him up? I've got to go and eat him. Did you if you watch any fighter in history that's six foot six and got long levers, how do they box? Behind their jab. Stick, move, stick, move. Anthony Joshua does it, it's a problem. You know what I'm trying to say? It's crazy. Okay, what do you want me to do? Box like Mike Tyson? Five foot. Am I in the holy field? No, I'm tall. I want to start using my range, using my using what God's given me, my range. Box from a distance, be clever. But each their own in it, styles. Maybe they want to see the old, reckless, not thinking, brawn before brains, AJ. This is chess, not checkers. So yeah, I, um, I can do what I want in that ring, when I want. That's the blessing. He tries to give off that energy too much. Just relax, bro. Why are you punching a, a mattress? And, and why is your, your mate videoing it and telling you to post it? Like, why is your mate telling you that's a great idea? I'd have said, bro, are you dumb? What, what are you doing? I'd have said to him, are you stupid? What are you doing? Like, why are you... Listen, we all do crazy stuff, man. So, I don't know. Maybe I might punch a pillow and put it up. As I said, kids, right? Control. 
Step, hook, there, body, step back, right hand, roll, there, 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 there. You can practice here, you can practice your control. Practice your control. Come up close, come up close, come up close, come up. Come up, close. Come up. Whip there, whip there, whip there, whip there, whip there, whip there. Whip there. You can practice, isn't it? Every day you can practice on every, everything that you got around you. Like that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, bro. <laughs> Get down the jumper cell. Get yourself a mattress. You'll be the next heavyweight champion in the world. <laughs> what does it take to be a Hall of Famer? Being a world champion? Fight the best of your era. Fight the best of your era. But then I feel like that when, you, when we try and compare like errors, Boxing changes so much due to like um, opinions, like sales, like what's attractive at the time. You know what I mean? So it's like, what, I say, what makes a Hall of Famer in today's era versus then? If you beat Dillian, Wilder, and Fury, yeah. you're in the Hall of Fame. Yeah, definitely. No pressure. pressure. <laughs> you want that it's kind fun. of recognition within the sport? No. As being a Hall of Famer? Nah. What about the best of your era? I used to. <clears throat> that's what that's what hurt when I lost to Usyk. I used to. But it's hard to get that notoriety as a British fighter. If I was American, it would be different. Notoriety or respect? Respect. Tyson Fury went 12 rounds with Otto Wallin and he was like, yeah, brilliant 12 rounds. Good to get 12 rounds under his belt. Speaking of third person, Anthony Joshua goes 12 rounds with Jermaine Franklin. It's like, oh, he's washed up. He ain't the same fighter. And I'm like, how? <laughs> how? Like, but then he goes and has a great fight with Wilder next. Whatever God's plan is, I say, everything will come to pass in the future. But right now, I'm going through the process. Sparring the other day, and I fucking like, threw a combo, and I thought, I was like, that, that, that was me. Like, that was the shit. I was like, yeah, like, that is it. And, uh, Without Derek telling me, make it my own, I would have been trying to do exactly what he expected of me, what I interpreted he expected of me. So I'm able to now be like myself as well. Do you think Dillian can drag out that old version of you or have you matured? If he's good enough. I, it wasn't, I didn't think I was good enough. That's why I had to fight like that. Fight like, <laughs> what type of boxing is that? Come on. All right, fair enough, I'm a five foot blockbuster fighter. Yeah, I'm six foot side. I should be pat, 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 pat. Do you know what I'm saying? Beating fighters there, like bang, bang, like slick boxing. I should be like, obviously pressuring him, but doing it in a calculated way. How did Duran and these guys go 15 rounds and leave the room without a mark on their face? Oh, you got the wrong person asking the questions. No. Right? <laughs> you got the wrong person. That's, that's no, no, no. Two great British heavyweights, two Londoners, with an incredible rivalry from the amateurs and in the pros that do battle at the O2 Arena all over again for their career, for world championship ambitions, but for pride. You know, to be able to take victory away from this. You'll see it today. AJ wants this so bad. Dillian White wants this so bad. And there's going to be a huge amount of drama in and out of the ring before we go to the O2 on August the 12th.